Okay, the next one in our contract relax series is partner cross-legged sitting. So if you go to a, a good yoga class, they'll often have you uh, just sit forward there, Jordan, just put your hands out in front. So you can see what happens when we sit this way, that the whole IT bands into the glutes, into the lumbosacral fascia is all being asked to, to lengthen. And you can once again see this spine that I'm talking about in every situation. And then what they'll do from there, they'll put you on your shins and you'll actually open up this way. And so you go between those two postures of opening up the front and opening up the back. So now we want to look at a sophisticated way to keep this opening happening so that we can really get into these hips and the, the uh, lumbosacral area. So Jordan's already well set up. Important that the front ankle is just slightly forward of the knee. On this, on this front leg and when we do this posture we want to we wanna do it twice because we want to do it with the right leg forward and then the left leg forward so it's important that we do both legs in the forward position and then what the partner does is come on to the back in a squat and so you're really lining up through your sacrums although I'll be just slightly higher than that so if you can keep migrating down Jordan now what, what Jordan's also doing is actually using my spine on his as a frame of reference so that he doesn't actually flex his spine, he keeps its length. And if he does that really well, the opening he'll get through the hips and low back is quite profound. And then what I can do to look after myself in this top position is support my head so I'm not overloading the deep neck flexors. And then I can just be in um, a nice gentle amount of extension while Jordan's in flexion. And obviously when we change, you know, and I go into the position, we're both getting our needs met. I'd recommend staying in this position for a minimum of 20 breaths if you can, long, slow breaths. Because although it can be strong, the, the actual benefits that you're creating for your spine and for your hips is quite remarkable. Okay, so we've migrated down nicely. Now to come out of this I just start to lift, create a situation where I can get a hand down and then just come up gently like so and then Jordan can come out of the posture and we'll just show, so just change your front leg there Jordan, so just adjust. So this is what I mean when I say we do both legs. So now the left leg's in the front position with the ankle just very slightly forward of the knee and we'd repeat the exercise. So this is the cross-legged sitting for IT bands, hips and the low back area.